electricity in the house. I can feel it. you want to do. They are so deep and so good. It's all about team for this West Virginia group. They're so active. They're in your face. West Virginia has the ability to take the ball out of your best player's hands. They take pride in playing defense. West Virginia. Carter might be the best defensive on the ball player in the nation. West Virginia. He is such a solid player. Defensively, offensively, he helps him. He loves putting pressure on the basketball. Carter, number one in the Big 12, and number seven in America in steals, just under three a game. No one does it better. You have to stop the basketball. Javon Carter knows that better than anybody in college basketball because he does that better than anybody. Here's where Press Virginia excels when Nathan Adrian's in the game. You watch Adrian, since he's a little kid, he dreamed of wearing the Mountaineer uniform. He plays with such passion and pride, a terrific student in school. He makes as many hustle plays as anybody in this league. But one of the country's best offensive rebounders because his effort is relentless. But he is the heart and soul of this Press Virginia. They're going wacky here. They're all going wacky. Unbelievable. Come on. West Virginia. Are you serious? Show me a better environment. Phillip is one of the best defensive guards in this whole league. Shows it every night. See it. everything he does. He's got tremendous focus as his player. Streak Phillip, the sixth man of the year. Sagamon Kanate. Now he comes down and says, hey, I'm a human eraser. Don't bring that in here, baby. Don't bring that in here. Well, Bob Huggins in his 10th year. Career win number 800. 800 wins amongst the Goliaths of college basketball. The only two active coaches that have more career wins than Bob Huggins are Mike Krzyzewski and Jim Bayon. Bob Huggins will be in the Hall of Fame at some point. Just a joy to be around. Bob Huggins had these kids ready to play and execute because they're executing really well. You better be tough when you play West Virginia because not, they're not backing down from anyone. They reflect their coach's personality. Dexter Balls Jr. knocks it down. They got to find a mob because this is his night. And now the steal and make it with a finish. Oh my God. Lamont West, remember the name. Did a terrific job here. I love Tavon Myers. He's a confident senior. That one launch and knocked down by James Long. How about that? On senior night, he gets the start and he gets him on the board. Bob Huggins doesn't have players with resumes that even approach that. And yet, year after year, he finds a way to mold this team. West Virginia! into this kind of fine-tuned machine that presses and traps and gets turnovers, and they just keep on winning. To the right wing to Tavon Myers. He penetrates, shoots a layup, it is good, and the ball. Tavon starts to penetrate into a crowd, fires underneath the rock, and slam dunk, great dish for Myers. Macon, Macon, power move, drop step, layup shot, good, and a foul. Sends it out to Tariq Phillip for a three in the air. Swift! Hey, one time! Three, one time! Holding, 
gets the ball in, but it's stolen by Carter. Here comes Javon, into the front court, to the right wing, Miles, three, good! It's up double figures, equaling its largest lead in a turnover. Lacan lost it, four on two, Carter to Adrian, to Ahmad, layup, goaltended, it's good! Here's the ball back to Nate, clock eight, long NBA three, Adrian hit it! It was Motley, bounced it to Lindsley, three stolen Phillip. Tariq out ahead to Watkins, uncontested, two-hand slam. That was big, another turn. Inbound, the ball stolen by Carter. He throws it up front to Phillip. Phillip puts up a floater, got it to go. Dribbles, McCann stolen from Miles, out ahead to Carter, uncontested. Hill put it up and in. Rebound Carter, out ahead. He's got Adrian. Here's Nathan going in. Nathan dunks it down with two hands. Another assist by Carter. And perfection is pierced. The Baylor Bears lose for the first time this season, and for the second time in two years, West Virginia knocks off the number one team in the nation. Oh, oh. the ball, Adrian gives the ball back left corner, Carter lines up for a three, got it! Carter gets by Mason, penetrates in the lane, gets it out to the right wing. Made Adrian puts a three in the air. Got it! Adrian with the three. Goes in for a slam dunk. Rejected by Canate. He penetrates back to that right wing. Now Adrian's three is good. And Bill Self takes a timeout. Call your friends, you better watch. Are you serious, he said? That's unbelievable. They're fired up, baby, you can see it. Gets the ball to Nate Adrian, gonna line up for a three ball. He hit it! Nathan Adrian spurt. Macon, Macon, turn around, jumper off glass. Good over Lucas. Through the lane he goes, penetrates all the way in, layup up and good for Tariq Phillip. I mean, they've come out here at halftime and really played exceptionally well. In the 59, Lamont right wing, in deep right corner. Lamont West gonna try another three ball. He got it. That's his spot. Rejected out of bounds by Elijah Macon. Fakes the three, sends the ball right side. Lamont goes in, lays it up and in. He it. Oh, Are you serious? Are you serious? They're dancing, baby. Handoff up top to Carter. Carter. Carter penetrates. Gets it right corner. Miles for a three. Got it! 153 to go! And Carter eight. hit the three! Oh, they're jumping with joy. I'm bumping away. The mountain is. They say we are back, baby. We are back. Look back to Carter. Two on the clock. Here's a three for Javon. Got it! They're not going to be denied tonight, baby. The WVU Coliseum has become a mausoleum for another number one team. It's over for the second time this season. West Virginia knocks off number one. Penetrates, gets the defender up, sends it underneath the Canate. Slam dunk over Marik Isom. Hello, Sagabaugh Canate. Rejected by Canate. Here's Phillip in the front court. Phillip to the top of the circle. Gives it out front, Carter pushes up a straightaway three. Good! Center of the rim, rebound Nathan into the hands of Carter. Here comes Javon, beating everyone down the floor is Miles. Miles goes in, slam, dunks over Yancey. To Adrian, underneath to Canate, two-hand slam. Adrian with a great look. Timeout taken by Texas. Down to three, two, one, and it is on to the semifinals for the West Virginia Mountaineers. Adrian couldn't get it inside the Watkins. Adrian penetrates in, gets the ball left wing. Here's Phillip for a three, swished it in. Carter starts to penetrate, gets the ball to right wing. Ahmad, three in the air. Good for Issa Ahmad. West Virginia's down two. Javon holds it. Canate sets a screen. Carter going to try the three. Got it! Ahmad into the hands of Carter. Carter penetrates into the lane, puts on the brakes, gets it in the left corner. Phillips shoots for a three. Got it! The game is tied by Tariq Phillip at 50. Stokes gives up his dribble, blocks it three, blocks it two, throws up a prayer for the win. No good, ball tipped. It's over! West Virginia has survived. They've advanced to the championship game. The number four seed in the West region, the Mountaineers of West Virginia, and they will meet 
the bison of Bucknell out of the Patriot League. Now Nate starts to drive, spins into the lane, puts on the brakes, fall away 14-footer, off back iron, rolling up and in, and Nathan Adrian's got 10 points. Here comes Javon Carter. He's over midcourt with six. Carter to the middle of the lane, gets the ball underneath the West. He pump fakes, he shoots, he scores with two to go in the half. The ball stolen on Adrian. Adrian to West, slam dunk! Lamont West ripped it down with one hand. Get in the deep right corner, Carter gonna try a three ball. He yeah. swished it in! Javon Carter, he 2-1, and it is on to the second round of the NCAA tournament for West Virginia. Win on three, win on three, one, two, three, win! Ball gets loose into the lane. Ball stolen again by West Virginia. On a run out here come the Mountaineers. Carter attacking. Carter to the bucket. Carter scoops, shoots, scores. Javon's got eight. West Virginia leads 15 to four. Jump pass. Right side, stolen by Phillip. Down the floor. Miles makes the catch. Miles goes in, lays it up and in off the steal. What penetrates him. Back to Phillip. Underneath. Slam dunk. Sagamon Canate, Tariq Phillip with a nice dish. Not a good set there. There's a Steal on the inbound, Miles, Ahmad, slam dunk! Shot clock 12, he's gonna try another straightaway three. He got it, Tariq Phillip! Carter still up front with five, Carter with four, gets to Ahmad, he's gonna try the three. He hit it, Ahmad for three from the far left side in front of the WB bench. Shot clock's at three, gonna have to shoot on desperation. He got it for three! Ahmad penetrates alley oop blocks. Slam dunk to Dexter Miles! As the clock winds down to four, three, two, one. Do you know the way to San Jose? Yes, it is West Virginia. Onto the Sweet 16 with an 83-71 victory over the Irish of Notre Dame. West Virginia, this is who they are. They press on makes, they press on misses, they press on free throw situations, and it really takes the ball out of the other team's best players. You can't run offense. It is impossible to run offense against this team. And, and the great thing is about the people in the state of West Virginia is they love West Virginia. They just absolutely love West Virginia, and they love West Virginia University. And I have a question about Cincinnati, but you know, we don't have the Bengals, and we don't have the Reds, and we don't have the Indians, and we don't have the Cavaliers, or the Browns. We have West Virginia University. And so every kid grows up wearing a hat that says the V on it, or they wear a shirt, or they wear a pair of pants, or whatever that has a WV on it. And whether they go to the university or not, they're West Virginia fans. And so we've had West Virginia fans throughout the country because if you grow up there, you're a West Virginia fan. It's just a way of life. And that's why I try to uh, have our guys understand what they represent. Senator Manchin said to him one time, he said, you know, once you put that uniform on and you have that West Virginia across your chest and you run out there, you know, people talk about representing your team and your family. He said it's way more than that here. You're representing your team, your family, your university, and the entire state. And that's a hell of a responsibility when you think about it. I try to just, you know, pound that in our guys' heads all the time. But, but man, you're, re you're representing 1.5 million people. You're just not representing yourself anymore. That's the neat thing about it. It doesn't happen a lot of places. 